Hello everyone, are you all excited how to create a portfolio using HTML and CSS? Just come in my way, I'll show you the path. Firstly, create a folder like this and open it in Windows Terminal. Enter code space dot. Now you can create another folder called uh, portfolio dot HTML to create the HTML file portfolio dot css to create a css file yes now i will uh, give the basic code of html that is the header tag at the linking section uh, i have given the title as personal portfolio web design or you can change as your wish whatever you can give and i have linked the style dot css Can link it as portfolio.css and you can use these uh, google apis dot uh, these are the fonts i have imported and this is the uh, this is the cdn i have imported to import the icons font of some website and coming to the body tag here i have given the navigation bar and you can see i have uh, imported uh, uh, an image where it is in the assets folder you can see this logo.jpg i have created and i have pasted here now you can see the output here you can see this image very big we can style it is later according to our size and here you can see the buttons over here and we'll style it now for that we have to add the CSS now let us paste it in the CSS section I have given the uh, this styling to the entire section this is the universal pointer and then uh, this is the root section we can access and for the body i have given some background and the color and the navigation bar i have given all these stylings to align the items in a right position and image the width and height of the image i have adjusted and the navigation bar and the contents in the navigation bar uh, let us see the output now you can see the output over here the image is uh, kept in a left top corner accordingly and the navigation bar is also you can see the hovering effect over here i have added the hover effect over here and now let us create home section about us here you can see in the home home section i have added the text over here h4 means the smaller size and h1 means the bigger size and some buttons over here let us see the output let us check the output once again yes you can see the output of the home page i'll explain the here you can see i have added uh, the text over here and i have added the hire me button for this animation i have uh, added the firstly i have uh, given this background image over here and i have uh, added this image which is the strips image uh, where we can give this hovering effect and i have used this web kit background clip application so that it will slide like this and i have given this keyframe stack to use this background 100 percent and all the basic css i have added to each and everything and now let us create the and let us add the css see here in the about section about is the thing where it reflects about a person and here i have added some text about me and i'm a passionate about my work uh, kind of thing and i have given some skills over here i have given some skills over here and i have added the certifications academics awards and achievements and education 
using the details tag this tag gives us that in the summary if we keep any text it will show as a heading and that if we add any content it will show as a drop down i will show you here you can see this is the service tag i have used you can see the drop down everything i have given here and also uh, the hovering effect to the service tag you can see these are hovering if i hover the mouse over there this hovering effect and these icons i have imported from font or some website the hovering effect will be seen here this hover now let us create the portfolio section here now we can verify the output yes this is my portfolio section uh, where i kept all my projects i have done in my internship this is my first project ktm landing page and if you go to this link it will take you to the landing page this is my second project in this portfolio section i have added i have created a class called portfolio in that again i have created a container and i have added a sub subtitle as my work and i have given these images and the text and the links for that over here and coming to css this is the css for all the things over there you can see that hovering effect over here and now let us create the skill section and let us add the css for that skill section this verify the output once again yes the skills and services section is also created i will explain the code and in the skill section i have created a main class services class and in that i have given the text and i have given the pictures over there and i have adjust the size of the picture using css and then i have added uh, the text about my skills about each of my skill and i have added the css accordingly now let us create the footer page that is contact section now let us uh, check the final output yes the contact section is also created you can see the hover effect over here as you may and you can see if i click this it will directly open my resume view it and then you can fill out this section to message me and i have made these two sections compulsory so that if i didn't fill this section it will give the warning as this please fill out this section and now you can also see that if i click any of my social media page it will redirect to my social media page directly and you can see these hover effects and these hover effects i'll explain the code of the contact section i have just added the contact me uh, text over here and i have given my email id and mobile number the random thing whatever you can give you can see over here where you can see this mobile number and gmail and here you can i have uh, imported these icons of social media from fontasm and i have attached my resume here and i have given these css for this and the final output of my portfolio is here you go hovering effect in the navigation bar and the sliding effect this hovering effect my photo and this hovering effect and this service tag and this hovering effect the best part 